Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. This is lecture series 30 introduction to IOT. In this video, I am going to tell about the important question, discuss about the important question in each of your module. Hope you have prepared for your tomorrow's exam. So this is module one. These are uh, some questions that I have taken from model question paper where your module one has uh, uh, some questions which deals with physical topologies, IOT, uh, uh, planes, interdependency and network communication between host interdependency and reach of IOT uh, based on different application characteristic features of IOT system. So these are some model question uh, questions. And in module two, you have a difference between uh, transducer sensors and actuators and different types of actuators you have to compare those types of actuators and uh, you will be uh, no um, you'll be writing or studying about the available sensors used for uh, a different sensing application then what is the actuation mechanism and the common characteristics of actuators when used for selection so this comes under module 2 in module 3 you will have offsite remote processing topologies and you will be explaining about the offloading strategies or you have to learn about the structured and unstructured data with examples. Uh, then you will be uh, studying about processing offloading that is IoT deployment. So these are some model question papers, uh, questions that, taken, that is taken from question papers for module 3. And module 4 will be dealing with smart irrigation management system and uh, there are some uh, uh, deployment model of the cloud that is required. So all these will be uh, under module 4 and you have a virtualization technique which is very important in module 4 because this virtualization technique has been asked many times. Uh, and also this uh, sensor cloud platform and cloud sim. So these uh, or choice questions are much important because it is often asked at many question paper and next is about the uh, module 5 uh, where in module 5 you will be studying about the in vehicular environments that is fog Pfizer and also the uh, hardware components and front end designs or you will be seeing about the machine learning techniques and the healthcare IOT in module 5. So these are uh, the important questions from the model question paper that I have taken and generally I have prepared some important questions for each of the module here you can see these are the important questions for module 1 where you have uh, uh, advantages of explaining about the network topologies make thorough of what is network topologies what is point to point and multi point connection and uh, start learning about the difference between LAN, MAN, WAN and uh, MAN and uh, you can learn about the OSI uh, model completely and start learning about the importance of IoT and differentiation between IoT, M2M, uh, the block diagram for those, all those you can start learning. And for module two, there are some uh, important questions based on sensors and transducer actuators. So characteristics of sensors, characteristics of actuators and actually what is the mechanism of actuators and different kinds of actuators must be explained thoroughly with neat diagrams and examples so all those all these are important questions in module 2 module 3 is you will be completely focusing on on site and off site processing structured and unstructured data so here you will be studying about the offload locations also so these are the important questions that comes under module 3 and finally, for module four, you can see some uh, SLA techniques that you have to study compulsorily, which is very, very important. And you should be thorough with the architecture of agricultural IoT and its components and its uh, application that is reaching to the uh, human. So all those under agricultural IoT, these are the important questions. And in module five, it is completely dealing with the application. So you will be completely seeing about the healthcare IoT and also the vehicular IoT. For safer side, you can also see what is machine, uh, machine learning algorithm and types of it also. So these are the different important questions that I have listed out. Hope this will be useful for you. Do your exams well, prepare well, see all other lecture series and make use of it. Thank you.